pick one superpower. Quick, 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 Wait, quick. Uh, uh, it- Alright, so in our previous episode, we talked a little bit about this dream that you had, right? Mm. And in that dream, you talked about teleportation. Tele- yeah, teleportation. Is that the superpower you would pick if you could have a superpower? Yes. Yeah? Hands freaking down. Why? Because it's most, it's the most practical. Right? It's like, mm-hmm. wherever I want to go, just poof. There I am. I mean, like, if I could just, if, if I don't have to see the place, mm-hmm. like, if I just heard about it, or yeah. I know where it roughly is in, like, the geographical map or whatever, I'm like, okay, I want to go to Paris, and I close my eyes, I open, it's like, like boom! Yeah, in Paris. There. Yeah, so I could have breakfast in Paris, uh-huh. lunch in Singapore, uh-huh. dinner in Tokyo, I don't know, wherever I want. Yeah. Okay, I mean, that that's kind of useful, but don't you think you would be, like, captured or anything? People would be like, Oh my god, it's a teleporting person. Let's go and capture them and then discover oh, the is... secret behind their abilities. You know what? I think I'll be too fast. You know? And then like, you see someone coming yeah, in. Yeah, just Ugh. boom. And it's not like, like by the time that I, I teleport to somewhere else, it's not like the embassy of that country would be like, look, that's the girl. You know? <laughs> right? It wouldn't be, they wouldn't notice me so fast. So, it, I mean, if it's that hard, probably, mm-hmm. you know, teleport to a cave somewhere. To hide out for a while. Okay, okay. Right? Yeah, it's, that makes sense. I, I'm not gonna use it for like greed or anything. I'm not uh-huh. gonna steal or or whatever. I'm uh-huh. just using it pure like purely for convenience sake. Mm-hmm. Right? And to save money to on travel flights and you know, time. Okay, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. But And and, and I wanna have the ability to bring somebody with me. Like give no. me a no, no 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 no, you can't do that. You <laughs> only can not? teleport. So you're like, okay, I'm gonna teleport there. Hey. FaceTime call. No, that's so sad. Hey, parents. Hey, Zhe. I I'm, I'm in Paris right now. Wish you were here. No, no, no. Instagram photo. Okay, no. In, in my version, mm-hmm. I get to bring people. Oh. I, like, you know, just hold hold on to them or they hold on to me and then we just teleport together. Zoop. Then you're there. Yes. I guess that kind of ties together with that episode we were talking about if you could drop everything. Oh, and right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. A it, bit. It's very much about the social connections that make it Yeah, I guess special. so. But like, if, if I really had to give that up and mm. I just had to travel on my own, that wouldn't be too bad either. Like, I mean, okay. traveling from home to school, uh-huh. like last time, I mean, even now, it's still like a bit of a distance. Mm-hmm. And it just really saves a lot of time if you can yeah. just... It's like instantly adding years to your life. Oh Ye- yeah. Years of of actually doing something rather yeah. than just yeah, sitting on a and, bus. And you know, you, if you sit on the bus, they say, "Oh, you're resting. Mm-hmm. You're you're like you know, you can always take a break on the bus because mm-hmm. you're not studying, mm-hmm. right?" But you can't really sleep. Uh, some people can't. I can't. You know, you probably can. I can. I just sit down. And <laughs> yeah. Okay. You need to find a seat. Ah, uh, that's true. Right. I mean, you, you can't do it standing. Some people can. Like, there I, are. I think my cousin can. <laughs> no, I mean I've seen people like holding the thing and then they're. Like, <laughs> and then you wake up, right? <laughs> but <laughs> but that's not really sleeping. Anymore. Exactly. Mm. It's like to make full use of your time. It's mm-hmm. just to cut down on transportation. Yeah. But although I mean I appreciate how you know the view is or, or how therapeutic sometimes traveling is, but mm-hmm. I would rather go on that as like an option rather than a necessity. Yeah. Yeah. Makes right? sense. What about you? What superpower would you pick? Hmm. Quick! 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 If <laughs> invisibility, <laughs> invisibility. <laughs> Yeah, why? Um, I've always liked the idea and the notion of invisibility. You can be all sneaky about stuff. Mm-hmm. Like, let's say I'm here now and I'm gonna get to somewhere and I don't want people to find out. Invisibility on! <laughs> and then I'll just go, right? Mm-hmm. And so you can that, sneak into clubs? You can sneak into clubs, you can sm- sneak into the ladies' bathroom. Oh, okay, I heard that. No. <laughs> you can um, use it to rob banks. Steal information. I think I think people will find out. Like if you're the only person that, that ever could, you know, be invisible mm-hmm. and then suddenly magically like money just disappears. Or like they see cash floating going into a of bank course, they're like, Who is this dude? Must be Jasper's. Yeah, that's true, but I'm not gonna use it so blatantly, you know. Right. I'll go somewhere that I'm not being followed, close the bathroom stall, disappear, unlock the thing. Crawl underneath or open it and get right, out. Right. Uh, if maybe I need to do some spy work and figure uh-huh, out what uh-huh. people are doing, I can just tail them for a while. Right, okay, you could be like a professional spy. Yeah. Uh, 
a secret intelligence officer. Yeah, yeah, intelligence. I think I think that would make more sense. Yeah. Rather than because it's it's way easier to obtain information if you are invisible in that sense. Mm-hmm. Then again, there's a lot of things that could go wrong with invisibility. Mm-hmm. For example, in this day and age where there's like, you know, sensors that sense when somebody oh, walks right. past. Oh right. Okay, that makes sense. Who knows how it will work? Like, well. Will those laser sensors be able to sense me or will I just go across it? Because the light will right. go through, right? But yeah. So, it's hard to say. Let's see, let's see if, if it does though. If, if they have the sensors. Then you have to be a real spy. You have to go like, ninja <laughs> your way through. <laughs> yes. And then do all the, all the like... Backflips and like, super yeah. acrobat stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then better go and train on Jackie Chan or something. Yeah, yeah. Or watch Chuck. You can learn a lot from Chuck. He Chuck. just has like, stuff in his brain. Okay, okay. Yeah. Claire's been pushing Chuck on me for a long time. It's a good show. I really, I really love it. I love Chuck. Mm. The guy too. But imagine what we could do with invisibility and teleportation. Yeah. You're like superhuman already. As in like, you're already superhuman, but you're like super, super. So... Super, super. Yeah, super, super. Wh- it's, it's what like applications would there be though? You could do anything that you want. Like, you can basically do everything with teleportation, right? Or invisibility, right? Other than travelling long distances and being invisible. Well, I guess so. But like, the teleportation aspect helps you to avoid lots of traps. That's like, true. imagine, okay, the stuff you're talking about, the sensor part, mm. you can always teleport to the other end of the room. Mm. Right? Or with uh, teleportation that, you know, uh, to help avoid people realising that, oh my god, she just disappeared in front of my eyes! Uh-huh. Right? Uh-huh. You could yeah. first go become invisible and then you do the teleportation. That after. doesn't make sense at all. You could go to the bathroom store, close it and then teleport out of there. Right? Oh. Then the bathroom store will be locked. <laughs> you unlock it and then teleport out of there. Right? <laughs> that is also true. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't know. There are loopholes in this. <laughs> but, I would say, both of them would be good for each other. Yeah, I would. Yes, I wouldn't. So you're know. saying both of us are good for each other? Uh, no, that's not On what I'm saying. On the internet video. That's not what I'm saying. No. Oh, Claudia. I'm saying the superpowers. Ah, that's what you mean. <laughs> I don't want to talk to you. <laughs> okay, you know how in comic books, there's always like people fighting people, and then they they have to find a way to sneakily use their superpowers. Kind of. Yeah. Yeah, I guess. Invisibility and teleportation have the same kind of benefits in terms of right, right. like killing an enemy very mm-hmm. quickly or very silently or very yeah, suddenly. Yeah. Like the element of surprise. Yeah, is the element there. of surprise is like at hundred percent. Ah, okay, I guess so. Yeah, hundred percent. Or like speed, you mm-hmm. know, like mm-hmm. um, like the Flash. The Flash or or the guy in the Avengers that like wears the headphones and he runs real fast. Ah, ah the Quicksilver. Ah, yeah, that guy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so like. If you can see things like that slow, mm-hmm. you could always have the element of surprise. That's true. Mm. Good thing that they are all good guys not going around killing people at random. Yes. Yeah. If not, you know, it would be... Good thing they're not you. I wouldn't kill people. Yeah, but you would steal from a bank. I would do it for good. As in, I'll do it for myself, but like... For good. For good, yeah. At the same time. Yeah. I see. I wouldn't create harm. You are stealing money. No la, just going to the girl's toilet. <laughs> no, that's not. That's, mm, mm. Better watch out for this puff. If you had to pick one superpower, what would it be? Leave it in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bloop bloop. <laughs>